We're at the Australian Automotive Research Centre Proving Ground at Anglesey, Victoria. Uh, today we've got our AIC Toyota Land Cruiser 300 series with us. We're gathering road load data today to understand how this vehicle performs off-road and on-road, unladen and laden. So as you would have seen from our previous videos, we've created the 300 series in the virtual space um, you, from all of our 3D scan data, all of our physical testing. So we know we've got an accurate model that performs as a OEM 300 series would perform. And we know that we've got the strength of that chassis dialed in. The final piece of the puzzle here is to understand what load is actually going to be put into the chassis uh, while it's being used. We've got instrumentation on every corner of the vehicle. We've got accelerometers, we've got um, linear displacement sensors, we have strain gauges, we have inertial measurement units inside the vehicle. It's instrumented up with everything we've got and we're going to be driving this vehicle on and off road in different conditions to understand what the performance is and what the life uh, is going to be on the OEM vehicle. So then we can use that and apply that to our customers' GVM kits. So we're going to be running the vehicle, uh, we're going to be doing some um, steady state manoeuvres on bitumen, so circles, and we're going to be doing some lane change tests, stopping tests, just to understand those acceleration limits that the vehicle is going to be ex experiencing. And then we're going to be going on the rough course to make sure we really find the limits of you know, the wheel travel and, and the accelerations for the actual wheel itself as opposed to the whole vehicle. Then we're going to progress on to the rough road surfaces and various uh, rough courses to understand what are the accelerations the wheels are seeing or you know uh, when we're getting bump stop engagement and things like that which will give you a good representation of the worst case that this vehicle is probably going to see in its life when it's fully loaded running over a really rough dirt road at higher speeds uh, and then all that will get fed into the model with the modified suspension which is going to alter how they actually perform to understand at the high GVM with the high spring rates and the different damping rates, what the life is of our customers aftermarket GVM upgrade kits.